Boss Incorporated, and I'm here today to talk about the Collector 34 inch battery powered sweeper. And we're here to talk candidly about some of the great features on this machine and what they can do for you. In this part of the video on the Collector 34, we'd like to show you the simplicity of the operation of the machine. We're going to work from the operator's left to the operator's right. So, first, right here is we have the handle flap assembly that allows us to be able to allow large debris to enter the sweeping chamber and to be able to recover it and drop it into the tank assembly. The next thing we have located in the center of the machine right here is the bail. And that allows for our automatic speed control. So the harder we or tighter we, we hold it, the faster the machine goes as we release it will go to a stop. So it's very simple by design that way. If you happen to park the machine on an incline or you're done at the end of the day, we have the handle park, parking brake. And you simply put it in that position and it will lock the wheels to keep the machine from creeping or moving in any direction. And then when, when you're ready to operate the next day, release and you're good to go. When we move on down to the closer side of the uh, chassis of the machine, we have our handle assembly here, which releases uh, the my hopper assembly, so you got easy access for removal. As you move to the center of the control console, we got our keys that are removable for safety, and then also they turn the machine on and off. Just to the right of that, you're going to see two LED lights. The one at the top will tell you what is the charge cycle in as you're charging the batteries. The one on the lower will give you the state of discharge as you're operating the machine, and then how the battery is discharging during operation. Located to the right of that is your side room, up and down. It's as simple as that. And then last but not least, located to the left and to the right of the handle assembly are the two adjustable thumb screws that allow you to adjust the handle assembly to the perfect height of the operator for perfect ergonomic operation. The third thing we're going to go through is the simplicity of the machine in and of itself. It comes with a safety key, and you just simply turn and lift up the hood accordingly. Now what we have here is very easy access to serviceability of the machine. We have easy access uh, to the maintenance-free AGM batteries, which come standard with the Collector 34. We have easy access to the motor and primary components for service, so your total cost of operation is much lower, so you have immediate contact points to get to without having to remove certain items in order to get to a part that you might want to do preventive maintenance on or just basic service. The next thing we want to talk about is the simplicity of the filter system. It's all done toolless. Just simply remove a couple of thumb screws and then I'll just simply remove the shroud. One of the advantages we're working from the clean side here, we're not having the dust fall down upon us or get all over our clothing, and we can simply remove this filter, and we have very easy access to it for maintenance, so we can very easily uh, vacuum it out. And this filter has uh, pleats located uh, on the inside here, and each one of them has a separator so that the pleats do not collapse on themselves, so you get maximum wear life with this filter assembly uh, on this Collector 34. It also has nomenclature on the top on how to properly put it back once you have serviced it. And that just simply allows you to drop in like so, and it's just that simple. Another thing that we also incorporate is a very simple sh uh, filter shaker. So it doesn't require an electronic device that would repair, uh, require repair over time. You just simply shake this back and forth and it will shake the pleats out once the machine's in the off position and that's all you have to do. So it's very simple by design, total lower cost of ownership and virtually anybody can do it. It's just that simple. Once you're done, you just simply replace it like so, put your shroud back in place and you're good to go. If you ever have to be operating this machine in a wet condition, where you had a light rain outside, we have what we call a wet bypass. It's located right here, and that will turn off the airflow assembly to the filter assembly. Once that is done and you're in a dry application, you simply close it like that. It will reactivate the vacuum system and you'll have dustless operation. So that's the purpose of this assembly right here. Now one of the things that's unique about the Collector 34 is the way that they designed the hopper assembly. The hopper assembly is designed to be in two pieces as opposed to one. 
And the big advantage of that is, is it breaks up the weight of the hopper for the individual who's using the machine, and it's much more ergonomic for them to be able to empty the hopper. And I'd like to be able to demonstrate that to you right now. So to do so, I just simply take this little handle here and push the push handle forward, and you will see that the hopper dropped down. I'm gonna to step to the side, and I'm gonna simply remove the hopper, just simply with just one hand each, and you will see that they are broken up into two sections. Now the thing that makes this Collector 34 unique is it has what they call an overthrow sweeper. And the advantage of that is it picks up the debris and will fill 100% of the hopper. That's as opposed to a direct throw sweeper, where it will only pick up a fraction of the amount of debris that this machine can pick up. So that reduces your total cost of labor and thus reduces your total cost of operation of the machine. So that could be a five to one ratio. And that's very important to you because uh, emptying and filling and labor is a total cost of everyday maintenance. And we want to keep that as low as possible. I'm going to spin these around so you get a good idea of what they look like. These are all made of what we call polyrotationally molded polyethylene. They're very safe, similar to your garbage cans at home. And they're designed in an engineered way that when the operator lifts them, they will automatically balance and allow the operator to have good ergonomic design when they go to empty it in their trash receptacle. Once that's done, simply place them back in place and we'll drop one in, just simply like that. Its little brother goes in the exact same way. Simple as that. Once they're located in place, we'll take our handle assembly, it locks into place, and you're ready for your next sweeping assignment. It's just that simple. Another nice feature about the Power Boss Collector 34 is it has an onboard charger. And what that will allow you to do is, regardless of where you are in your sweeping application, you can go up to any outlet and take the cord assembly or the charger assembly and just simply plug it in. It will automatically sense how low the batteries are. It will automatically charge the batteries and then it will automatically turn off once the batteries are fully charged. So it makes it very simple for the operator. It's pretty much a plug and play type operation and there's no more to it than that. And last but not least, what we'd like to explain to you is how we back up Power Boss 34 Sweeper. As far as the warranties are concerned, we will give you a five-year parts warranty against any types of defects in the craftsmanship of the machine and a three-year labor warranty. Not only that, but anything you see in orange as far as poly housing assemblies, we will give you a full 10-year warranty against any types of defects in the molding of those parts. So here at Power Boss, we back you up all the way, and uh, we want to, on behalf of the entire family, thank you for the time watching this candid overview, and feel free to contact right here at powerboss.com and reach out to us, and we'll answer any questions that you have as it relates to any of our product, or specifically, the Collector 34. This is Will Capel. Thank you very much. Make it a great day.